go. Right. Now, I, I have a, a customer and a friend who um, had very, very bad acne as a young child, but she's in her... Just quickly say the date. The oh, date. Sorry, okay, so today is Sunday, the 27th of November, and we are just having our basic training and formal chat, and we're kicking it off with a couple of questions, and I'm starting first because I'm recording. <laughs> okay, thank you. <laughs> so, my question... Well, I have two questions, really. My first one yeah. is Genius Pads. Um, I have a customer who had had very, very bad acne as a, as a teenager. So that nothing's red anymore. It's all scarring. You know, the marks that you have from scarring. Yeah. Is it past anything now or would the Genius Pads help with that? Her skin looks Genius. phenomenal now she's using RE9, but... Okay, Genius Pads will help. They will help. What do they do in that sense? The retinoid. It's like a pure form of vitamin A. Okay. And so if you think your skin is the vitamin A and the D, well, it actually almost changes the skin cell formation. Okay. So will your it, skin will cells it, are renewing every 45 it days. Is it what? Will it even up like where the, the marks yeah. are? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh, okay. Then I have another lady that I was speaking to who she told me what it's called, but I can't remember what it is. You know, when you get the dark shadows and to her, she was joking. We were joking about it. It looks like mascara is just running down her eyes. But she got it through being pregnant. And I know other women, you know, I can't think what it's called, mm. something with M. And she said she used to wear a cover-up concealer that the company she's using doesn't make anymore. And I was looking at thinking, I wonder if the ultra pads, the genius pads would work for that. Would they work for that? Yes. Yes. Again, pigmentation. Okay. Yes. All right. Fantastic. Yeah. Need to get some yeah. samples in them then. Cool. Right. Thank you. Thank, Thank you. you. Yay. Okay. Rebecca Dean is here in the house. You know, Harry Potter covered under the stairs. Well, no door there, but she's under the stairs. Um, Rebecca, how are you? Unmute, unmute yourself, sweetie. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's been one of those days. But how is everybody? Everybody all right? Good, good. Yeah, I'm fine, I'm fine. Just uh, piddling along, but I'm okay. Are we pedalling uphill or is it flat in the Netherlands and in the in the in all the? Uh, we're, we're, I'm in the fence, so it's quite oh. flat. <laughs> a bit marshy at times, is it? Oh God, definitely. <laughs> You're getting a bit wet. Oh yeah. <laughs> wet and dirty, or we like it muddy. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Especially when it sprays all the way up your back as well, then you just have that look all about you, you know. Um, I, interestingly enough, I did a, I helped, helped one of the girls on our team do a fate in, um, Oundle at the school, the junior school, and Liz came up to me yeah. and said, oh, I, I know Rebecca Dean and I, I'm my preferred client and I buy from her. And I'm like, whoa, that's amazing. I said, but she showed you the genius yet and the facial oil and she didn't know about it. So I was like, right, come here. So whether she liked it or not, I gave her a wee demonstration. No pressure, Andrew, you know, um, because didn't need to, but I did. I was like, oh, come here quickly. Kind of like, I could see she was like, well, I buy it. So I think she was a bit like, I don't need to buy it. I'm like, no, 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 just feel the genius. You're going to love it. So she felt it. And she said, oh, it's lovely. I said, oh, okay. I said, anyway, I said, I love Rebecca. She's great. And that was Thank that. But yeah. Thank you, you know, very much. Sorry, you know when you try on people in face, do you, because I always do it on the back of their hand. Do you do it on their hand or their face? Hand. Mm -hmm. I normally do a drop of the facial oh. oil and yeah. the hand. Yeah. Just because if they've makeup there or, you know, yeah, it's, it's just, yeah, the hand. They can Clean compare hands. Well, isn't it? Yeah. Okay. Great. Cool. Have you got anything, Rebecca? No, no, I'm all right, thank you. I'm fine. Okay, thank you, darling. And Leslie um, Lambeth, I don't know, uh, right now there's no, oh, oh, she's unmuted herself. I have, darling. <laughs> Hi, Leslie. Hi. Hello, darling. I've got my lovely family around, so I'm just kind of like tapping in and tapping out. <laughs> oh, that's great. Okay, cool, cool. Well, thank you for tapping in and tapping out. It's oh. great to have you on the call. Oh, bless you. <laughs> oh, I love it. I love it. So, <laughs> welcome, everybody. Oh, my gosh. Basic training. I'm going to talk about key well, hero products that I use. There is so much. The range... When I start, you know, obviously when I started, there was, I think it wasn't probably even maybe just a hundred products. And now there's well in, ex in excess of 500 products. So you tend to find when you go to parties, you know, for me, it depends. You can have this type of style party, which is great. So you can be specific in makeup and margarita. Hey, Nikki March, and she's just joined. Um, okay. 
that's okay that's okay great to have you on um and then if you're doing like a spa party so the focus is on the spa products um you know obviously makeup party on the makeup um if you're doing a mother a workshop mother daughter um if you're doing a health and wellness workshop great it doesn't matter what workshop you're doing your owners you'll be using specific products for that i feel though that i would always like to take a product from each range apart from if i'm if i'm doing it say a health and wellness workshop i will still take one whole gold bag set and an ft5 set okay because they are have always been and always will be the bread and butter of our business okay so and i and, and but the other part is i will still bring one of each so there'll be I'll, and i'll show in a minute what those key product key um hero products i will bring because funny enough you know what they may be there because they're invited for a friend to come to help them on this workshop but actually they're not really interested in protein shake they don't work out but they love their baths okay so they would love the spa range okay so it's important to have a couple of things to represent that range and i've done spa parties in the past and and i've had i remember one time i i didn't not one person bought anything from the spa range because i put the feet in a bowl of water and i add in you know the, the you know the sachet you know and then I add the oil and and none of them bought the spa but they all bought the, the like the makeup some the primer some people bought you know um the shampoo it was like the weirdest thing so i felt like if i didn't have those products represented at that party i might have missed a sale okay so i so there's a lot to traipse around i do know that and also we're always mindful of the fact that if you have everything spread out there is so much that person would be thinking how much money do i need to to, to be able to afford to get all those products you know um so again you know it's not about minim it's not about making our products look expensive but it's also about understanding that there's so we don't want to do information overload of which today guys i'm still guilty of doing information overload okay um so we want to keep it short and sweet and clean um that people can you know engage with what we have to say and move on and also i love it if it's not just you presenting so so encourage people to ask questions at these events and encourage people to join in so before i start i have to share something because i don't know if i'm meant to do this or not but i'm so excited so just two takes because um <laughs> oh my god da, da, da. oh my god danny and i are giving gifts out for people who've earned things along the way okay so like top sponsor um mad people that you've promoted so check these out i don't know if you can see this i mean seriously the we, oh my god they're like the most stunning rings well Shulkov, obviously shulkovsky and i'm probably going to get told off of this but there's another one um oh my god it's like vegas on stage it's like <laughs> so we're going to be giving this at the christmas party um and announcing that the people have earned stunning Stunning, stunning. What do you think so far? Do you like? Oh my God, I'm so excited. I'm like, it was a candy shop. Ooh, so, isn't that gorgeous? So this is all Shulkovsky. What else have I got? Hold a minute. I still think um, it would have been to go on a Sunday, just before Christmas. Oh, That's like the most bonkers thing ever. Look at that. Are those rings? Oh, God, yes! Turning us into like... Uh, excuse me, Shulkovsky. Aren't they awesome? <laughs> Freaking skint now, but it's all good for the love of my team. <laughs> anyway, anyway, okay, uh, I'll, I'll probably get told off. Don't tell Danny I did that. I don't record this and don't post it. I'm joking. Too late. Oh, well, that's me in trouble Sorry. again. Never mind. <laughs> okay. <laughs> right, okay, so now I'm clearing the junk. Oh, not junk, I'm clearing the gorgeous of Gosky rings. Um, right, okay, let's get started on this training. So, okay. Okay, so I'm going to go through some key things. So, one thing I'm always going to talk about is the primer, okay? Um, the primer, all right? So, I can sell buckets of this. Okay, so, so pens and papers, I'm going to try and talk slowly here. If I get too fast, then just slow me down, okay? So, the primer. So people say, what does the primer do? Okay, so I say, if you paint a wall, if you don't prime that wall first, you're going to get color patches. Okay, so the primer's job is to sit on top of the skin. Okay, and because we're the only primer in the marketplace with no silicon in it, 
Okay, so what it's going to do, it's going to allow the pores to breathe under. Yeah, and so it's going to act as a protective layer, really. So stopping dust, pollutants, you know, um, anything on the outside from sinking into your pores. So people with blackheads, it's great. Um, it's great because um, it holds the foundation truer. So I know makeup artists, and of course, always mention Simon Cowell, the fact that he loves our primer, the fact that it's been in the Oscars on X Factor, that, you know, his makeup artist, you know, she's, you know, in Arbonne uses the products on him, but we're not going to pay him to endorse it. That's really, really important. But the reason why is because it gives light, means the, the color lasts truer all day long. So the foundation sat on top of the skin. There's no creasing, sliding or folding. Um, and so for wedding makeovers, it you know, means the wedding, the makeup lasts all day long. Um, even if you don't wear foundation, the primer can still be worn without foundation. That's really important because not everybody wears foundation. The biggest thing about primer, the one key ingredient, it's got horsetail extract. Okay, it's the derivative of a plant. It's the oldest plant known since the dinosaur age. And as we get older, our pores enlarge, but this will minimize the appearance of the large pores. So T-zone people, great, because it minimizes the appearance of the large pores. And actually, guys, if you were to look on the ingredients in a lot of the other products on the catalog, they feature the horsetail extract. For example, the scalp and hair vitalizer, that's because of the follicles. Yeah, and it's minimizing the appearance of large pores, so less fall, hair fall, hair breakage, is because of the horsetail extract. It is a, it's a, it's, it's a hero um, ingredient. Okay, primer. And I tend to put it on people's skin, fall them and rub it in, because it does leave a, like a silky feel on the hand that you're doing it with. But if you don't, you know, I make sure people with this, this is colorless and odorless, there's no pH in it, because its job is, is to, to sit on the skin. Okay, so that's primer. Meanwhile, guys, if you've got any questions, just ask me. The next thing I'm going to talk about always, so um, I'm going to talk about this, okay? This is the one I will use. It's a 24-hour body lotion. Now, if you have the Vogue, um, if all of you have with the Vogue where it talks about the top Swiss spas in the world, um, that's a great tool to use at one of your demonstrations. Um, because again, we see in pictures. So this is what I'm talking about here. This this time, okay. So this was featured in Vogue because obviously we give, get, we give free, we give products for free to Vogue. We've been featured it three times, so we don't pay for the advertising. But because our products are so incredible, they are featured. So I then, so obviously, I'm just going to move away. I'll come back to this in a minute. So the detoxifying rescue wash, okay. I'm going to say these are the top for spas in the world, and these are the top three the three products that they that you know Vogue highly recommended. And then I'll read the first one here is La Prairie at three hundred twenty five pounds. The second one is Cabo of Switzerland at ninety eight pounds, and the third one is Arbon at twenty eight pounds. So something that is up there, world class, that was featured in Harrods for four years, the preferred choice. You know, you'd look at that and think this is cheap and nasty. But the reason why is because we're not paying for the process of taking that product to market. And that's it. So there's a little bit of that DA in there. And I'm also going to say it says Arbonne is fast attaining cult status in Britain for its multiple solutions for face and body and a stop. So they can see this. Now, the detoxifying rescue wash is very difficult to showcase, okay, to put on people's skin. So that's why I use the 24 hour body because it's the same size as the detoxifying rescue wash, okay? Now I say to people in this range, we never say that our products are organic because there's no legal definition on that word organic. So 30% of our ingredients come from the sea. And in fact, our ingredients are um, wild crafted ingredients. And what that means, if you think of GMO, if you think of force feeding like a crop to grow in a greenhouse effect, but actually we go to various like all locations all over. For example, this is three miles off the Belgium coast that we source the algae, the sea spirulina, the sea kelp. Okay, there's no boats allowed for miles and miles. Okay, so this is we know we can source every ingredient to source. If that makes you can follow every ingredient. Okay, so. Our, our products are not organic because we don't say the word because, or we don't say organic because 
you know, there's no legal definition on the word organic. And also, petrol is organic. It comes from the ground. That's organic. It comes from the ground. Okay. So, why do we love the sparage? Because the transport system is what it's all about. Okay. We talk about absorption into the, you know, from a health and wellness products inside. And this is all about the transport system to aid the absorption. Now, you must know this when you're talking to people that, you know, I love, I got this from Nikki, okay? So, you know, she's, we always say the largest living, breathing organ is our skin, but every single pore is a mouth breathing. Nikki, I love that. And I've never forgotten that. I've taken with that with me because it really makes you see how your pores are actually mouths breathing, you know? So what we put on them is important. Um, and I'll say your acid mantle is your top layer of your skin and your sebum and your sweat create your acid mantle. So when you're born, you secrete minute natural oils and the sebum and sweat is very thin. So you can go in the sun and burn quickly. You know, you have eczema, you probably grow out of it. Well, guess what? Um, that's the acid mantle. Now, because of the acid, a lot of products you put onto the top layer of the skin isn't able, first of all, to dissolve. It gets dispersed because the acid eats. It's a bit like a Pac-Man, right? It breaks it up. Because of the transport system through the, the sea, Okay, it's a, it enables, enables the hydration to go down to the basal cell level as far down as it can. So when it says 24 hours, I mean it's 24 hours. So most hand creams and body lotions in the marketplace only have two hours hydration. And that's because of the mineral oil content. Okay, now you've done the game before, so you've already explained mineral oil. So this is 24 hours. So literally you have a shower, put it on, come back out, and then... And then you know, 25 hours later, have a shower. It's still in your skin. Okay, great for really like paper, like people got very thin legs, old people, um, sun, you know, like keeping holding the suntan, hydrating. Um, so it's really important that people know about hydro trap technology. Okay, that's why this is so good because it's trapping the the ability to trap it in case the good ingredients in, you know encapsulated to go into the skin with that acid mantle breaking that eating it away all right last a long time i would say as well the hydro trap technology is reversed when it comes to detoxify and rescue wash because that's an advanced pickup system okay so if you use normal shampoo shower gels they don't have the advanced ability to pick up any leftover sodium or sulfates or anything Okay, so what this does, so what the Detoxify Rescue Watch does, it picks up heavy metals like sweat and chlorine. So if you work out a lot, um, you know, so if you were to use that and also use normal shampoo shower gel, it's going to work at an optimum rate, you know, and also let them know that, you know, it, because of the pump system, you can use a hair, body and face. So if there's a man who's a swimmer or a runner, you know, doesn't want to be faffing with conditioner or whatever, this is a fantastic, well, the top side of wash like this is a, is a fantastic product. Okay, I'm always going to make people smell the deodorant, okay? Aluminium, magnesium, paraben-free, okay? And they know about parabens, okay? So bicarbonate of soda, mint, back to mother nature, okay? Um, Honestly, it's so fresh. Remember, so these wild craft ingredients are sourced. They are three months old when they come to when they come to our hands. Okay, shelf life is reduced by from six months to two years, depending on your product. Okay, so people need to know we may run out of products, but that's not a bad thing. It's because ingredients are that fresh. Okay, we're not shelf life for seven years, so that's a great product to share, and you will always get a massive. You know, 15 pound and a lot of people will say how and it does smell amazingly fresh and you know that. Now I'm honest with the products at these parties, or you know, I will say that I'm afraid I stink. <laughs> I do. <laughs> Sorry. Sorry, folks. Um, if you've ever been on that dance floor with me, you'll have experienced the joys. Oh, <laughs> I'm joking. I see Rebecca's face. Anyway. But I want to be honest because people say, does it work? Okay, because a lot of people I know use the stone, you know, they buy the stone and, um, and I'll say, look, for me personally, it was not enough. Most people it is. However, I was only using it one, two times. And, and Danny was the one who said, Fiona, how many times? I'm like, like normal? And she's like, no, 20 times. I'm like, you're joking, like a monkey. She's like, yeah, 20 times. So that's what I do. Um, on the road show for Glasgow, I did about two years ago, three years now, I can't remember. Somebody in the audience said to me, because I was saying, you know, I'm going to be honest. Yeah, it doesn't kind of work for me. And they said, do you use foot cream, our Arbonne foot cream? I was like, really? 
under my arms, but you put foot cream in on your foot, which absorbs into your foot. So it's the same thing. Thanks, Leslie. So anyway, so I ended up, that's what I do now, the foot cream and 20 times like a monkey. I still swear a little bit, but I don't smell. Okay. And of course it's all pure safe beneficial. What does beneficial mean? I want you to make sure that you let your audience really understand that pure, safe, beneficial. Beneficial is active ingredients. Okay, so tell people this. What's active ingredients? Active ingredients means it has to do something. And that's why if you've got anti-aging range in front of somebody and they react or they, you know, they think they react and they go a little bit red or tingly, it's because it's actually doing something. And that's why our results have 24 hour clinical results because it's doing something. So they maybe just have never had felt an active ingredient. Be careful with the spa range because there are active ingredients. So you, there's um, it, the, the detoxifying rescue wash, 16 years and over. There's an active ingredient in that, okay? Not for, any, not for people younger. There's also lavender. So watch with pregnant people in the oil and the gelée. I'm not saying that they're, you know, they're going to overdose on lavender and have the baby early, but they need to know there's lavender in there, okay? All right, next thing I need to do is talk about the baby cream, okay? So the nappy cream, okay? Um, you know, I love the fact that these are pediatrician tested, ophthalmologist tested, um, and dermatologist tested, but make sure you use the word pediatrician tested on the baby range, okay? People need to know that. Um, the fact, and use my story, you know, I've helped 60 babies with eczema because there's no um, mineral oil in any of our products, it's specifically the baby products. Now, why I love the nappy cream, in fact, it should be called a nappy cream, it's like a, it's, it, it shouldn't, but it is. It's because it, the, the reason why this product works so well, it's the only product in the marketplace that matches human sebum. Okay, remember I said at the start, sebum and sweat equals your acid mantle. So your human sebum, and that's why these weird rashes when you get bites, um, <laughs> when you want to lock in, you know, you, 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 you're treating eczema or rice patches and you want to lock it in, you know, with the oil, you'd add the oil to this, to the nappy cream. It is a phenomenal because it's human sebum. Okay, and great just for nappies anyway. So that, I will always mention that. That's the nappy range, okay? Um, right, next one. Um, I'm going to do um, the world's first alcohol-free hairspray. Um, you know, I, I won't bring my vibrant shampoo conditioner because you know when you open it, it doesn't really have a smell. So this definitely has a smell. Um, this definitely is going to go on people's skin, like the primer is. But obviously, I'm not going to go spray hairspray in the back of the hands. But I am going to let them know, shout out about the world's first alcohol-free hairspray because not many people know about that, and it's important. That's what I say. This is a vibrance range, and that's what it is. Okay, um, the FC5 range, I'm going to go through the steps, okay, but I will bring up our shampoo, okay, look at the size of the shampoo, okay, it's such a brilliant size, and I will say in this range, we have other shampoos in other range, but there is just one shampoo, so it doesn't matter if your hair is greasy, it doesn't matter if it's dry, curly, frizzy, this shampoo has got 5.5 correct pH, and that's why all our products are 5.5 correct. And that's why you just need one shampoo. Well, it doesn't matter what your hair type is like, because as long as it's going to the follicles at the right correct balance, the pH, sorry, the right, the correct pH, it's going to sort out that out. So you won't need to wash your hair every day as often, okay? So I will mention that. Now the FC5 range, um, is and and i know that last that i think two weeks ago i did a training on the gold bag and i and i did how i would approach people and what i would say for each um each product and unfortunately that wasn't recorded um we can do that again at another time um but i, I don't want to touch it now for those of you who, who are on that call you know, on this call um get excited about fc5 oh i have mentioned price bracket as well um you need to also pop in the price throughout the process so that people aren't scared or put off at the end when they see the price list, okay? Um, so for example, um, this is where I'm gonna bring in the price. The first price I bring into play is the cleanse and toner on the FC5, okay? And I'll say, okay, it's 21 pounds full retail, and of course I can offer you 20% discount. Um, this lasts you, that's six months, okay? Because, and you have to say, and I, I love this, it's become our code word, a dot is a lot, okay? The products are highly concentrated, so little goes a long way. 
So if that's the case, six threes are 18. Okay, it's lasted you six months. So we're talking about £3.20 a month for something that's pure, safe, beneficial, um, and you know that it works. So already you're breaking that into, and I probably say that, I'll say that on the, on the primer, I'll say on the, this, the, the face wash, uh, or the hand cream of the FC5. Um, I'll say, I'll say um, on the baby range as well, because um, I'll use one of these. So these are huge again, okay? So I'm probably saying, I'm gonna say it three times in one party, in one sitting, um, because again, I'm just planting the seed, the quality, of bespoke ingredients in our products is, is what this is about results okay um and the fact that it lasts for such a long time so when they come to get like i said they're not going to like have a heart attack because they're going to see it's 21 pound for a hand cream well i've never paid that in my life okay so they're already understanding what the pro how much it actually does cost when they break them down for the length of time it lasts because that's how you're going to sell okay right FC5. Um, by the way, for you new guys, if you're panicking right now in the corner thinking, she knows so much and I'm never, ever in a million years going to know all this stuff, use the catalogue. The catalogue is just, I've really, I'm repeating the catalogue. So at the beginning, you know, especially in your FC5, you know, get your catalogue, okay. Um, hold on a minute. Okay, so get your catalogue, okay, and you can actually stand and read, okay, because people are not going to judge you guys, okay, they, they, they're going to encourage you, the worse you are at the beginning, the better, because they want you to do well, all right, they want to be nice, the better you are, the more they feel like, you know, um, potentially you can feel like, who does she think she is, you never win with people, you never know, right, they might not, but you don't know, right, so who cares anyway, right, so it's not your job anyway, um, okay, so, let me just quickly get to the FC5 page. Um, right. Okay, so all I'm gonna to say to you now is this page here. So I just know this off by heart, okay? So you could start and on that page and read it. So what I'm gonna say is, okay, love. Now, our scientist, Petter Mork, has more, no, sorry, Dr. Petter Travis has more um, patents to his name than any of the scientists in the world. He has 26 patents to his name, okay? so. That is incredible. And one of his patents for four years is the FC5. So it stands for Fresh Cell 5. You're feeding your skin your five fresh fruit vegetables a day. Okay. And what are they? Carrot, mango, pumpkin, kiwi, and strawberry. Okay. So those are key ingredients. Um, and then what I'm going to say to them is it's innovative cell technology. So it's a bit like an eggshell. They've transferred the whole, the whole sort of, um, cell across and it's not been crushed in the process it's encapsulated the freshness okay and and so you could do this with a hand cream get it put, like, get them to put it on their hand okay and then say right smell it and i promise you this works and then you say okay now okay so rub in the hand cream and smell it again and you can you can smell the explosion of the the fresh fruits in the fc5 range and you say well that's why you've just broken down those eggshells and now you, you you know and i know when people are trying the products at a store and you know i can smell them from across the table if i'm like around the back so that's what i would say okay so so fc5 and then i would say so it's for normal skin oily skin no anti-aging in it um and then i would just say okay so this is a cleanser and i would tell them wash your face i would tap and dry it uh, I mean, sorry, a dot, okay, and then wash your face, clean your face, wash it off, tap it dry, you're done. Toner combined. The night, the eye cream of the FC5, obviously, we all know is in a tub, okay? Um, and I always ask people at parties, do you know what finger to apply your eye cream with? It's a bit of a joke, it's a bit of a lighthearted relief, but it's also quite important because it makes you look pretty smart. But most people don't know because, kind of, why would you know? You know, it's not like a common question out there. So, and then I, and then most people put up a finger and then um, I think most of you know about me doing this, but for you new people on the call, so then I'm going to ask them to put their hand either on, on the table or like to put their hand on the leg. Oh God, here we go. Oh, I better not go. If I fall and then you know why. Okay. If I, if this knocks out, I've knocked myself out and I'm just spice you can take over. Okay. So. I go around and wet myself with laughter. <laughs> no, right. So it's I uh, know this is no rude porn show, by the way, okay? So I'm just saying, right, so tie your finger in like that, and then you're going to lift your thumb and put it down, okay? Then you lift your forefinger, put it down. You lift your pinky, 
put it down, now lift your ring finger, and you actually can't, okay? Or get them to go like this, like, you know, as hard as you can, and you can see how strong the, your pinky is compared to your middle finger, okay? That's a really great thing to do, even on one-to-ones, guys, when you're meeting people and you're setting out the products for them to try. Speak about the eye cream, do you know which finger to apply? I'll tell you what, they'll be really grateful for that. You know, you've just given them a really important, valid point because your skin around your eyes is three to 20 times more finer. And it's the first case to show signs of aging. So you don't, you don't not want to drag that skin. So ring finger, Mother Nature gave us a wonderful bone structure around here. There's a reason. Nothing is meant to go above or below, okay? It's going to cause puffiness, okay? So we've got the lymph node, the drainage system, or the lymphatic drainage system, our tear duct. So what we want to do is put it around about here and then on that ring finger and tap it around like so. Okay, and then it's going to utilize and take it to where it needs to go. Um, and then I make a little joke, I kind of go, okay, so do you know that from there to there is the size of your foot? Sorry, from there to there, do you all know that? Raise your hands in the air right now on this call. Do you know that's your foot size? Great, I love it. It was almost like we're doing American, raise your hands. Donald Trump has landed. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, I hope nobody's uh, anyway. Okay, so from there's to measure height, right? Yes, we all know that. Yay? Did you not know that, Andrew? From that finger there to that finger there's your height. Oh. Yeah. You know when you're pregnant and you have a line going up your belly and the midwife measures that the line, 24 centimeters means you're 24 weeks. Did you have that? Probably. That, yeah. Long time ago now. Yeah, so that is true. Um, and then the next thing as well is and then I'll say, and um, I'm so happy my daughter's just bought it. Anyway, it doesn't matter. And I, no, no. I will. I will. I will. Um, and, then, and then I'll say, um, oh, and so, but if anybody wants to find out the size of a man's, and then I stop and they're all like laughing their heads off. I say, come and speak to me at the end. <laughs> I don't know, but, well, no, somebody did say it was like from there to there, but I'm not sure. I don't say that. I just like to make a joke of it. But anyway, it's having fun and it's creating a good laugh. You know, people, when you laugh, you cannot physically think. How wonderful is that? I keep laughing because you can never think. That's why I never think anymore. Um, right, okay. That's your FC5. So that's that. What time are we on? The next one I'm going to talk about is, um, okay, the men's range. I just want to touch on, again, the men's range. Um, I want to touch on the after um, uh, not the cleanser. Um, I mean, the men's range is more kind of like, um, I, I'm a bit, a bit naughty. I kind of sometimes ignore the men's range, but you know, it's important because, you know, men are coming through these days anyway. So what I would say is more of a general over blanket sweep statement on the men's products. I would say that, that the men's range, um, a lot of other products out there are not actually, um, designed and the, the technology into the products is not really dealing specifically with men's skin. Okay, they actually are using women's products and repackaging it for the men to buy and maybe putting a smell in there. So men's skin are different. In fact, the skin is finer than ours because of all the shaving. Um, and then, uh, um, what's that one, Andrea? Foot cream first or jelly? Oh, uh, Rebecca asked a question, so I was just answering it for her. Do you use the yes, foot cream Rebecca. first or deodorant first? what on oh we're talking about um i would probably do the um i'd probably do the deodorant oh do you i use the jelly what do you mean when i apply it oh. me oh no sorry foot cream first sorry so foot cream to absorb and then the deodorant to kind of like yeah yeah on top to seal almost i suppose yeah um and my deodorant always seems to angle itself up in a funny way I don't know what that's all about, but maybe that's just me. Maybe I need to, you know, roll it. Yeah. Okay. Be, and can I just say sometimes when you talk about the products, we do love the products, okay? We absolutely love the products, okay? Um, the men's time of year, yeah, for Christmas products, absolutely, Andrea. You know, you're right for women because they're looking for buy. But also be honest about the products. The products you are going to um, sell, you're welcome, Rebecca. The products you're going to sell the most will be the products that you love, funny enough, because the passion will come through. Because the words are 7%, the rest is how you make somebody feel, which is over 30%. So the general sweep on the men's products, I would just say, so they are made specifically for men's skin. I would say then that, you know, what happens is most men do not prepare the skin beforehand. So what we have is um, the men, the men's preparation, um, the, the cleanser, 
And what that's going to do is going to basically get rid of three quarters of the dead skin cells, which is sat on the top, okay? And it's going to start to open the pores, so to prepare the skin for the shave cream. And the problem is because most people, most guys just splash water, what they tend to find is that three quarters of the, um, the dead skin cells and the hairs are trapped in the razor blade. So they're still getting five o'clock shadow. But because with us, you're already preparing the skin, it's open and it's ready, then actually mo all the, most of that dead skin cells have been already, you know, or, or have left, so to speak. So when you shave, you get a closer shave, no five o'clock shadow. And also it extends the life rate of the razor because it's not trapped with all the hairs and the skin cells, okay? So I would then say, the cream, because it's not, there's um, not a natural property that allows a shaved foam to foam up. So it's like a little bit like cling foam. It just, it goes, it, you know, it goes over your skin, doesn't foam up. And then once you've shaven, they've got, you know, the camp, you've got afterwards the aloe vera, which is soothing, calming. And I know many, I've probably converted, but maybe a lot of men from Clarence, funnily enough, um, to our men's range. And there's no ingrown hairs. That's a thing of the past as well, I find. Um, so that's the men's range, okay? Can I just um, ask you, sorry, Fiona, on the men's range? Yeah. Remember we went on the Sue Alexander course a while ago and she was talking about comparing the men's range to the women's RE9. She said that before men had used the women's RE9, but there was one product in the, that they shouldn't, absolutely shouldn't use. What, can you remember what it was? No. No, no could I? Sorry. I was just wondering. Do you know, I don't know when you said that. I don't know 100%, but the eye cream popped into my head. Is it eye cream? Rebecca's agreeing. I think, yeah, it was. Was it eye cream, Rebecca? I think it was. I'm not 100% sure. Was it, Rebecca? Yeah, it's something like that because she said that men's skin is much um, thicker and oilier than ours. And um, and they, I think that they'd um, introduced the eye cream because it had got, um, it, it's, more, it's uh, much more absorbent into their skin because their skin is much thicker and oilier. That's, that's one of the mm. things. So it won't hurt them if they use the female one. It's just better for them to use the male yeah, one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Yeah. I think that's probably why they launched it in the new range, Andrea. Thank you, Rebecca, um, that, that, they, that they brought the men's eye cream out as well. Because they were using women's. Yeah. Um, okay. Right. Um, okay. So then I have, I'm just going to do the last one because... Um, I'm going to open up to any questions and I've got five minutes before the next call to tuck my little girl in and do a lullaby. So um, the next one is um, the calm. Okay. Um, we can continue this anyway because I haven't done all of them, but obviously it's always, you know, time, but calm range. Okay. Um, okay. So this is really for people who are very, very, very sensitive skin. So people would go, where do I put a person? What, what skin range do they belong? Okay. So the most, the most softest, soothing skin, um, skin cream that we apply, that we give is the baby range, ABC. Okay. Um, and because obviously baby, the baby lotion has got no SPF in it. The next stage is the calm range. Okay. There's only one fruit in the calm range and that's the cucumber. Everything else is made from um, like plants and herbs, okay? No SPF again. Um, so if I have somebody in the calm range and they're using this in a day, um, I'm actually gonna make sure that um, the night cream, I'm gonna give them a separate night cream, which is not probably the rejuvenating cream. Because I tend to find it's people who have rosacea, who have eczema, who need real, like sort of a, real, how can I put it? Like if the fruits and the vegetables are too overpowering, okay? so. They need something that's going to really hydrate. Um, and those are the safest. Um, and again, the green, you know, the intelligence rejuvenating cream. So again, you know, the, the red, so in the color chart, they're opposites. So again, that can help with the color as well. Um, I did have somebody who had gone through chemo and, and a store came up twice, had been given these products for our, our cancer charity. Um, and that's another thing, tell people about, you know, we donated 10,500 pounds to the UK Cancer Charity, you could feel great. And she had had these products and she came up looking for this, to trial these products. And I actually ended up putting her on the rejuvenating cream because this was so thinned out by all the steroids she'd been using um, through all the treatment. Um, and I put her also, she was, she, she wasn't, her skin wasn't powerful enough on RNA, but I put her on the FC5 um, normal d nurturing day lotion um, with the rejuvenating cream. So the two of them she's combining in the day um, and then just the rejuvenating cream at the night um, with intelligence facial oil as well. So she's going to help build thicken up this bit here. Um, 
I remember having a little boy who kept licking his lips and he had all red and, and I gave him rejuvenation cream to his mom and that went. Because remember, like a steroid is three times a day and like, um, you know, it's 200, you can do up to 200 times a day if you are using Arbonne because it's all natural. Okay, so I'm going to say with this, um, again, you know, Josh is a lot. What I'd love to tell people is that the pump system, okay, it's a pre-measured amount of antioxidants, proteins, minerals, vitamins. Let them know that they've been nurturing. So it's not just about cleaning their face, it's about feeding the skin. You know, with the makeup, 10 and 1 CC cream, you know, let them really truly understand that we are actually helping our skin to feel better and look younger and become better, get stronger if the skin has been weakened by steroid creams or mineral oil or or exposure to sun over the years. Um, and then I'm just gonna say that, you know, exactly the products and that there's no SPF 20. So that is it on the calm. All right, does anybody have any um, questions before we go? And um, of, of the product lines, the hero products I've talked to tonight. I was talking to a customer um, yesterday who has, is on her third bottle of calm. And I said to her that when she finished, I'd, Tell me if I was right or wrong here. I said to her, when she's finished her third bottle of Calm Moisturizer, I'd like her to try the FC5 because it's got SPF in because her skin now on her third bottle should have re, sort of resettled and sorted itself out. Was that all right? Yeah, perfect. And I think and as well, because you're building up, absolutely right, Andrea. You might have on the third bottle have introduced the, rejuve, the, the FC5 with it. So yeah. she, it's like a, you know, rather than a stop start okay. um, because then she would have had easing her off this and then, putting it into the other ones so the and what transition is like, or, like two days use calm two days use sc5 no mix them mix them okay. initially okay yeah well, I can mix them initially yeah yeah but that's fine but you've done the right thing and this what i've said to her so she's got a she's got the fc5 and she's got the calm the rejuvenation cream mixed and then eventually it's going to get to so in six months time we're going to put her on the anti-aging and see how she goes and give her that trial process and not just the whole range at once we're going to bring in like the cleanser you know just easier and step by step so we don't overload her skin thank you you're welcome well done good job yeah you did you did what well. you did right girl you good girl um okay anything else for anybody no, we're all happy because we're all, I can see the energy is just pumping. <laughs> Come on, ladies, it's well, Sunday night. <laughs> I know, well, Nikki is, and she's the one I'm here. <laughs> I know, look, she's on it. Nikki, you're quiet tonight. Make such a nice change. Ah! Look, mate, I've been doing orders whilst you've been doing this. I've been learning and earning at the same time, girlfriend. Oh. Go, I yeah. love it. See, I expect no less. Right, on that note then, we have got five minutes, four minutes and counting. Good to see before. everybody! Oh, I know. Oh, bless. Look at, look at all these you, lovely... Andrea? I haven't seen you for ages. You've been quiet this week, Andrea. Which one? What have you been Which... doing? Been up to stuff? <laughs> Which one? Which one? Which one? Anyway, we're not, we're not... Uh, excuse me, Miss Triangle. Um, <laughs> I love it. Um, we are going, we are going to anyway. I want to know which Andrea you're talking to, so I can follow up. Which one? <laughs> Andrea, not Andrea. Uh, oh, that that the the foreigner. <laughs> love her, love her, love her. Okay, cool, cool. Right, I shall love you, leave you, and Andrea Spice. Well done, would, you, well would you mind posting this for me, my lovely? On the key. Thank you, thank you. Namaste. And um, see you on the next call. And so proud of you. Rock it out. We have four days or three days tomorrow to the end of month. We're going to be rocking this month, okay? And then the bling bling. There you go. Oh, anyway. Wait, did you show it to me? I did, yes. Anyway, lucky. <laughs> bye. Bye. Happy to see you all. Take care. Bye. No, they, they, no, they, well, they're, they're able to see.